Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Sound Union. Yay! This is the first, the first, number one, the first membership, member, completely member initiated member showcase, and we hope this to be the first of many, many, many such member showcases. If you've never been to Sound Union before, welcome. Uh, housekeeping bathrooms, there, you can go right down these stairs, right here, they're right over there by the red light, but down there, <laughs> they're downstairs. Um, when you go downstairs, be sure to take a peek into all the various and sundry kinds of studios and things that we have here, especially if you've never been here before. And I highly, strongly encourage you to go to soundunion.com and make, a, make an appointment for a tour. This place is pretty awesome. Um, if you have been here before, welcome back. Um, Cool, thing about, cool things about performances, oh my gosh, I should tell you who I am first. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> my name is, not that I'm anybody. <laughs> my name is Lisa Gleaton and I'm currently the acting events director for events that happen on this loft stage. So, <laughs> okay. so some cool things about this particular place is that um, if you go to soundunion.com and click on events, you'll see that there are several um, events coming up with um, touring professional independent musicians who definitely see the value in playing in a really nice, small, intimate place like this. So if you'd like to hear some really good music uh, after tonight, um, please um, check that page out. And um, that's, the tickets are really reasonably priced for the peninsula and the tickets include an adult beverage, very similar to what you see downstairs. So just that right there, I think you're saving money by coming to our shows. Um, this particular event, um, I'm saying it's member initiated because members got together and decided that they wanted to play a show and talked to other members and even in the case of my, my particular band, formed a little band just to be able to play. And that is a super cool part of Sound Union membership is the opportunity to perform like you'll see tonight. So any members out there, I know you're out there, I see you, um, you're next. Um, also members attend the events here for free. Um, there might be a special thing that has a premium if it's like a course or a workshop or something like that. But for even when the touring pros come, if you're a member, um, members attend the performances here for free. Um, for all info on memberships, concerts, tickets, etc., please check out soundunion.com. All right, cool things about tonight. Completely member initiated. Um, David Hobbs and Zell Young will be presenting original music and they'll introduce themselves. I know, yes. That hashtag life goals. Um, they'll introduce themselves as we get going. Um, just to keep us remembering some of the songs that we also know and have heard before. There's a group called Teacher's Lounge that is made up of all teachers, current and former teachers from across the street of Sequoia High School. who are just gonna play a few covers right in the middle so that everybody can kind of sing along. Um, we love these songs, so we hope you like them as much as we do. There are flyers on the tables, or some tables and on some seats that look like this. And this is especially so that if you are enjoying the music that you're hearing that David Hobbs is playing, here's his QR code. Just scan it real quick and it'll take you to his music on Spotify, his album, his social media, all that good stuff. And same with Zale, I think he, yes, he's on this side. Um, same with Zale, Teacher's Lounge, nah, Te nah. <laughs> We're not streaming, <laughs> we're just having a good time. And we hope that, uh, we hope you enjoy what we do. Um, we'll try to keep the breaks between the groups uh, brief, but please feel free at any time to go downstairs and refresh your glass or use a restroom or just get a break. Um, and I think that's it. So uh, we're gonna get this shindig started with David Hobbs and his band. Thank you.
So big thanks to Lisa for all her work as events coordinator, and you guys are in for a treat. She has downplayed Teacher's Lounge, but they are gonna blow you away. So. <laughs> you good? dark out there. We were playing to the, uh, to like the secret society or something. <laughs> um, I am David Hobbs. This is Chris Summers, Vincent Robinson. Um, it's, it's, it's great to be here. And as Lisa said, like it's so, this place is, is such a great place to, to meet people and have opportunities to, uh, to play music. And yeah, it's especially these days, I feel like we need music. So, um, I'm gonna play, we're gonna play some songs that are off an album that I'm in the process of releasing. Uh, this is the title track, not quite yet released, but it's called Searching for a Home. Desert all around. 
is uh, today they had a, uh, a workshop called, I think it was like Elevate Your Presence. It was about uh, elevating your stage presence. <laughs> so you can all critique me afterwards, give me some feedback. Um, but anyway, I think, I think I, he's really elevating. <laughs> Am I elevating? You are so elevating. Uh, um, so anyway, I, I show up to this thing late. <laughs> And, uh, and I'm like, hey, I'm sorry, I, I can't, I can't stay uh, very long. I'm so behind on all the stuff I got to get do to get ready for the show tonight. But is there anything you could recommend, like just a quick tip? And she was like, yeah, be prepared. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. All right. uh, Speaking of what, what song are we doing next? Oh, we're doing We Are Wild. Oh, oh yeah. All right. So this is another song uh, up album. This one is actually out now. So you can actually find this afterwards if you're so disposed. <laughs> Oh, 
fun. Let's jump into the melee and claim what is ours. We'll burn. to uh, do us a couple songs with us. I made I made roasted potatoes for for my son earlier this week, and I hadn't made them for a while, and they're so good. For whatever reason, today I was like, I, I really want some roasted potatoes. So I went to like two stores to find potatoes to roast before coming here. <laughs> sometimes I just sometimes I don't know what to make myself. Most of the time. Your songs are amazing. another song that is uh, out in the stream of verse now. Uh, it's called Beautiful Bee. Uh, it's one of the older, older, older ones that I've, I've written and uh, you can find it online. I 
I think about those yesterdays And that afternoon when I met you Like newborn flowers in the sun Filled with promises of something new La -da -da. La da 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 oh, oh, oh. oh. On that day we went our separate ways Were you sad or glad I couldn't tell All the ways I'd let you down All the ways we loved so well Beautiful, beautiful bee Flying merrily and free but Those days are gone But you keep buzzing along with me Those days are gone So uh, this song's about Lulu, who uh, called me up one day. We were gonna do a, we were rehearsing to do a sh uh, play our first uh, show together, uh, literally the night that they called the lockdown for COVID. And Dad insulted me, then she told me she was leaving for New York. So this is a little fantastical view of Lulu called Lulu Left Town. <laughs>
All right, so uh, the last song of our set here is, uh, it does have a little story behind it, I'll have to tell you. Um, so uh, my friend Andrew, who's here tonight, um, took me clothes shopping uh, up in, see another, he could probably key into this elevate your stage presence thing, because he's a very fashionable guy. And so he takes me up to go, to the, to go clothes shopping, we go up to the hate in San Francisco. Uh, and, and he's taking, he, putting me in some stuff that is a little bit out of my comfort zone, and I'm looking in the mirror, at this shirt that he has me in, and this, this woman walks in, um, as far as I can tell, with her boyfriend and holding a cocktail, and she, she like locks eyes with me, and I'm like, hey, what do you think of this shirt? Um, and, and she's like, uh, what do you think, what do you mean? And I was like, well, is it attractive? She says, well, it depends who you're trying to attract. <laughs> <laughs> and so, <laughs> so I, was, I thought, all right, I, I, might, I probably need a little joint help here. So she takes me on this whole, like, you know, thing through the store and she's trying clothes on and she kind of gets me an outfit that she likes, which I frankly think looks just as out of my comfort zone as the one Andrew had me in. <laughs> anyway, she looks me up and down and I, I was wearing shoes, not these shoes. I should probably wear the other shoes I was wearing for this story, but um, <laughs> but she looks me up and she's like, mm-hmm. And then she looks down at my shoes and she's like, okay, those shoes, burn them. <laughs> and she said it with such conviction that it just really stuck with me. I couldn't get that out of my head. Like, burn. I was like, oh, fine. They're, I don't know. It seemed reasonable. So anyway, I, was, I just had to say, stuck around this. Maybe this could be a song. I was like, how can I write a song called Burn the Shoes? But anyway, this is going to be the song Burn the Shoes once I finish my thing. <laughs> See, if I take do, do you have those shoes by I, any chance? I do have the shoes. You do have them. I should bring them at least as a prop. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm just saying. The next gig. Next gig. All right. You, we'll have to have another member showcase to uh, have the other shoes. Oh, and I wanted to say, like, this is just throwing down the gauntlet for the next members to step up and do the next showcase number two. We call it number one for a reason. For a reason. All right. Here we go, Corner Shoes. There is a sing-along part. Chris will clue you into that. <laughs> Oh, 
So at Sequoia High School across the street, um, every year, at least when I was there, do they still have it? No, they would have a um, talent show. No more. Well, that's because I left. <laughs> Actually, after when you left. <laughs> um, anyway, there was this wonderful talent show, student talent show, that they really, really need to bring back because it was so awesome for the teaching staff, for all the adults on campus, to see students in this completely different way than what we were used to in our English or history or photography classes um, when we were all teaching there. Um, but every year, the staff would make a band. Uh, we knew when the date was for the um, talent show, and we would put a band together, and it was always a lot of fun. <laughs> and um, several years, I was in the Sequoia High School staff band. Usually, we were called Paper Jam, <laughs> the Hall Passes. Um, I'm not sure, but I think it was John Davila who decided that we would be called Teacher's Lounge. And when he um, sent that to me, he wrote that we were called Teacher's Lounge. He didn't put the apostrophe. Um, and we're English teachers, so um, I loved it because teachers do lounge. Like, so I was just taking it that way. But um, we couldn't resist. We had to put the apostrophe back in. Um, but there was nothing more fun than the weeks that we would um, get together in one of multiple of our classrooms and try to pick a couple of songs to just stun the kids with. Because the same way 
that we sometimes fail by seeing them as only this person who's in our classroom for this short period of time and not these whole wonderful people, they definitely saw us the same way. So they were always stunned that we had any abilities whatsoever um, outside the classroom. So um, definitely good anyway. to get your friends. Okay. So yeah, de yeah. After her, after that's true. I would say we had a lot of um, student cred after the the, the talent shows. Um, so I'm just going to say that we're going to sing four covers for you. These were um, songs that we were messing around with in one of the studios um, that we just liked. And then one day David Hobbs walked by and introduced himself and he said, do you guys want me to like jump in on drums or something? We were like, yes, um, because drums are always necessary. And, um, and that's how we met him. And then like the next Wednesday, um, he may or, I don't know, it was the next Wednesday or another one after that, but he may or may not come back and just said, so I've got a little bit of time, you want me to jump in again? And we're like, yes. And then that, those two happenstance meetings in one of these studios um, led to today. So um, with that, we're going to just sing four songs, please, or play four songs. Um, this is Jonathan Hoffman. Um, that is Mrs. Jonathan Hoffman, <laughs> who's fabulous, who is also a teacher at Menlo Atherton. Jonathan is teaching at Sequoia. Um, he's going to play guitar. This is the amazing Kate Sheehan, uh, former photography and art teacher, who will be playing mandolin and keys. Um, and I'm Lisa Gleaton again. Yeah. Um, thank you, Amy. <laughs> um, so um, one awesome thing for me. Keep going, Jonathan. I like <laughs> this. Is John, this is me. Wrap it up, Lisa. One awesome thing for me about sound is I keep getting to hear lots of music that I didn't hear the first 61 years of my life. Um, you may have heard them, but what I've learned is that, you know, you can only hear so much. And certainly when you're growing up, you're influenced by what your parents listen to and then by what your friends are listening to. And no matter what, you're not going to be able to hear it all. Um, so I'm really thrilled to be singing um, some of the songs we're doing now because I just wasn't familiar with them. And this almost embarrassed to say, but it's okay. I didn't know this song before, like, a few months ago. So, here we go.
old man, look at my life, I'm a lot like you were. Old man, look at my life, I'm a lot like you <laughs> but Jonathan introduced me to the Chris Cornell version. Um, had a plug there. <laughs> um, but we decided to do something in between and then changed it at the last minute anyway. So this is our version of Nothing Compares to You. Sometimes hard 
but I'm willing to give it another try. Nothing compares, nothing compares to you. Nothing compares, nothing compares to you, to you. Jonathan and I are big Jason Isbell fans, and uh, so yeah, we, we can't not do a Jason Isbell song. We're super excited. We got really good tickets um, in the in July at the Mountain Winery to see him. Um, no problem. So if you were here for the Valentine's uh, showcase, we we did this then, but um, we like it. We're doing it again. Some days alone, 
Maybe we'll get 40 years together But one day I'll be gone Or one day you'll be Me too. I'm sorry, I still haven't even heard a second radio hit song yet. <laughs> sorry.
I'm basically. Um, we'll come back at the end, but um, Zale is up next.
Hey everyone. Sorry, I have a little set up here. Many instruments. Uh, yeah, hi. Um, my name is Zale, and these are my friends. I will introduce them as we go along. Uh, first of all, thank you all for coming. Um, I love you all. Thank you. Thanks to Sound Union for hosting this, making this happen. Thanks to Jordan and Tom on the sound over there. They're doing great work. Um, yeah. And can we have another round of applause for David Hobbs and Teachers Lounge? Thanks to David and Lisa also for making this happen. They, they really did this. Um, yeah, so I'm Zale. Um, so my music is a little different. Um, so some of you saw me play at the Valentine's Day show, and that was more of my mellow side. This <laughs> side of me is, a, is, I'll showcase a different side of me today. Um, uh, some of you know I am from Jamaica, and so a lot of my music is influenced by, you know, reggae and dancehall and that uh, culture. And uh, if at any point you're like, "What's he saying?" It's it's because I'm not only speaking English. I'm kind of code mixing between patois and English. Patois is the language you speak in Jamaica, so just want to like preface that. Um, <laughs> So, yeah, thank you all for coming, and let's get started. Wait, uh, let me introduce the song a bit. So this first song is called Master. Um, I, so there's a quote that I really like. Um, it's one of my favorite quotes. It says, the master has failed more times than the beginner has even tried. And that quote has helped me a lot in my journey and overcoming fear of failure and stuff like that. And I think during rehearsal once we were like talking about like hitting the wrong note and then I, I said, what did I say? Like, if it's the wrong note, it's just jazz or something. Like that. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, so yeah. I, I wish you guys a lot of jazz in your life. <laughs> and this is not jazz though, just yes. <laughs> <laughs> Only for the wrong notes. Well, yeah. <laughs> Every day I lick a laughter Energy I lick a breath and the moon will faster My life may have heart of the journey we after Anytime I will fall to a mind get broader Master is the game, manufacture the yard, that's it to play on the front 
to see you're the strategy of fate You know you're onto something when you start to feel afraid Failure is just a word for the practice It's the thing that you put you want some different tactics Fact is, every loss is an advantage The masters fail more than the novice Laughter Energy I look a brand and move like a faster My life me a lot to the journey we after Anytime we'll fall to a mind get broken This next song is called Endeavors, right? Endeavors? Yeah. <laughs> Endeavors. <laughs> um, yeah, so I wrote this song. Uh, this was the first song in a series of songs that I did where I was releasing one song per week. I was making and releasing one song per week. It didn't last very long, but <laughs> um, I, at the moment, I felt like I was on, I have, I have big dreams and I was on this endeavor and that, yeah, I, and yeah, I don't know. So I wish you all well, on your endeavors in life. <laughs> yes. Oh, I should talk more. Uh, <laughs> um, I don't know what to say, but like, thank you all for coming out. Um, What's your next endeavor to say, all? My next thank endeavor. You for oh. <laughs> I don't know, my next endeavor is just to play more music. Uh, oh. This, I, I, I haven't performed in a while. Like, the Valentine's Day show was the first time I performed in a long time. And I think my next endeavor is to just perform a lot more. So, uh, yeah, thanks for being a part of that. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 
and I'm so sick as my barrier. Not to go sit there so I will for sorry for killing my parents for I make me happier. Yeah. Me and the only champion trying to go on. Her is a freedom I call. You don't know what to do for my life. Help on the path. Find my way. Never been a passenger. Leave me in a church. Build in my heart. When he left my heart. Find my stage. So I'm feeling a part of it all. next song is called Journey. Um, same vein on a journey, you know. Uh, um, this song hasn't been released yet. Um, uh, I think, let's say May, let's say the beginning of May. Um, yeah, uh, it will be released on all streaming platforms. And yeah, this song it's fun. The way we're playing it doesn't sound anything like the actual recording. This is the first song I've made where I didn't make the music. So um, there was a, another producer from Jamaica who made this the music for this song. And it's really good. Um, but yeah, that's uh, so excited about that. But yeah, I'm really excited about the release of that song. How's everybody doing? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> doing good. What are those instruments? So these instruments are called tablas, and <coughs> Harsh here is a classically trained tabla. Is what do you call it? What do you call it? Tabla is that? Um, <laughs> yeah, and classically trained singer as well. Like this guy, this guy. Oh, no. 
are the children of the most high stay close by pay attention to the lessons of the whole try read the wisdom and the blessings from the pros try don't walk with your third eye closed it's a discovery i will carry on my brothers in the bottom and could i never look in like the colony when you pray on the sun of the chronology you will see all of the power when we come in every step i take make a resonance in the middle of the spiritual renaissance we have a whole ocean, we have to get across Journey Journey It is a journey Every day I'm gonna learn I'm gonna keep the fire burning Energy in the yearning In the yearning It is a journey Every day I'm gonna learn I'm gonna keep the fire burning So we step in heavy But oh, when they knock it with them semi-automatic traffic drop We have to pop as a bully Could not stop with black Who walks through the truth Then follow your dish And don't drag it with the true sense Feel like a soul from the cavalry Invent a new self Rising up out of the ash We start a revolution A time to wake up Let the state arrive Remain alive The place will shake up We cannot make a change Unless we be the change You can't just hide behind the blame It's not the same Darkling Thrush. Um, this is actually the first song I released, uh, and yeah, so the, the, the name is named after a poem by the poet Thomas Hardy. Uh, I really enjoyed that poem. So the poem was about a bird, um, a thrush, this type of bird, I guess. Uh, and this guy was, you know, in the desolate winter, and he saw this thrush that had so much joy and life and magic and he was like what you know is this thrush aware of that I am not and he found such new meaning by watching the you know the life inside this thrush um, so that inspired the song it's not about a bird but I guess the song is about love and you know if you meet someone and you see kind of like a light in them and that attracts you in that way so that's the story of this song so yeah, thank you. Zell, I had this dream. I think I'm having it right now. <laughs> I'm blushing. <laughs> and I've 
Sunday. Um, I'm really happy about this song. Uh, I don't think, I don't think you guys tomorrow. know this. Um, yeah, it's tomorrow. Sunday's tomorrow. Um, but oh, what? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> uh, this song um, was.
was also in that series when I was doing a song per week. Um, I'm really excited about this song because uh, this is news. Like this song got played on the radio in Jamaica for the first time. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, it got played on the radio in Nigeria as well. So people seem to like it. Um, we're doing a different rendition of it though. But yeah, listen, take a listen if you want to. <laughs>
Gonna come back on for an encore yeah. with Lisa. <laughs> yeah, so let's do it. And Jonathan. Woo! Let's give it up for Zale and his band, his amazing band. I don't, I, I don't know where you went, Zale, but I don't know if it's you personally or your or or the or something having to do with Jamaica. But every time I hear you talk, I just feel like everything's gonna be okay. <laughs> and uh, and Chris, I got some news for you. Uh, American flag. Dancing, you, you got some uh, next next set. American flag. I want to see some dancing. I feel like I feel like you were just showing up, and you know. I also want to say thanks to the uh, the Orion contingent that's here from Orion School. Um, somehow this place has be kind of become kind of a home away of home from home from for parents from from uh, with kids in the Orion school but it means a lot to me that you guys came out and got a babysitter and stuff like that so thank you <laughs> uh, so we're gonna do one last song we wanted to get uh, at least some of us together can put everybody on stage um, this is a song that, um, yeah, right after COVID ended, yeah. I was uh, going up to San Francisco to hear uh, Ray LaMontagne play a show. I'm a fan Thanks. of Ray LaMontagne. And, um, I know who that is. 
You don't know who Ray, Ray LaMontagne is? I oh, you do. do. Yes. You do. So you learn. So, okay. So Radiohead and Ray LaMontagne were slowly, slowly, slowly getting up to speed. Um, anyway, I was driving through San Francisco on my on my way up there, and uh, just everything. I hadn't been up there in a long time, and I just sort of realized like everything reminded me of something. Um, so. That's, uh, this song's uh, called Water Gone By, and we will wait until... I should probably tune too, huh? <laughs> I feel like people in the audience should get a discount for guitarists tuning their guitars. Because <laughs> it, it takes a lot of time. Thanks to uh, Jordan and Tom for their work on sound. Yeah! Uh, every time we come here, it's, they're so helpful and appreciate it, guys. Captured by your smile 
the way it greets your eyes. We are underneath the dragons, you are telling me your lies. Hand in hand we stand as the rivers rushing by, rushing by our feet. All the things we share together, they're flowing out, flowing out to the sea. Water gone by, water gone by. Dancing in the waves, the memories of the days gone by. Remember, there's more, um, more David Hobbs, more Zale. Um, just check out these QR codes to find some more information and more music. <laughs> 